On Wednesday's installment of The Repair Shop, BBC viewers saw host Jay Blades and his team back in the workshop to bring people's beloved items back to their former glory. However, during the episode, one woman didn't want her historic shoes fixed but preserved due to their importance. Bringing in the pair of shoes in a clear box, Nahama explained to Jay Blades and Cobbler Dean Westmoreland they were given to her when she was one year old. Explaining to them both she was born in Tel Aviv, she detailed how her parents were born in Poland and decided to move there before the Second World War. The repair shop guest told Jay her parents, who were Jewish, moved separately to Tel Aviv where they then met as they wanted a better future. Sadly, Muhammad explained the rest of her parents' family, including her grandparents, aunts and uncles stayed in Poland and died in the Holocaust. Huge discounts at Amazon, the time is running out Amazon just launched its latest site-wide sale. Not all of these discounts are worthy of your time, but we've found the 23 best Amazon Spring Sale deals with genuine record low prices. Better hurry as the sale ends soon. She said, so, me and my parents, we were the family, the only family. Speaking about the importance of the shoes, the 83-year-old confessed it was the only tangible object she has from her mum and dad. However, Jay noticed both of the shoes had been worn out at the toes and he questioned how that came to be. Nahama explained, those times, the situation was not so good. Tough life and my father didn't turn much. They wanted me to use them as long as I can. They cut here and my toes went out, for a few months more, I can use the shoes. The guest told Jay and Dean she kept the shoes to one day give to her own children and for them to be passed on in her memory. She explained she didn't want Dean to fully repair the shoes but to restore them to how they would have looked on the last day she wore them as a child. When Dean said about restoring the shoes, he confessed it was in his nature to strip them down and replace them with something new. He said, but, it's really important to Nahama that I preserve all the history here. So in the spirit of conversation and preservation, I'm not going to go too far with these. Don't miss. Holly Willoughby apologizes to Sally Lindsay over Paul O'Grady blunder, latest, Coronation Street's Ryan Connor star details scene cut from harrowing, latest, Giovanni Pernice faces most terrifying ordeal in heartfelt reunion, latest, once Dean had managed to get the shoes back to a suitable condition without stripping away too much of their history, it was time for Nahama to return. Walking back into the workshop, it was time for her to see the shoes that represented her family's story and the fight to survive in a post-war world. Seeing them for the first time, she was moved to tears, she said, Wow, I thought I wouldn't cry, but I'm going to cry. After witnessing her happiness Jay Blade seemed overcome by Nahama's reaction as he had to blink hard to stop himself from crying. She said, it fills my heart with happiness, I must say. I wish my parents could see them. You have made an old lady very happy. When they left, after giving her a new box to display them in, Jay said to Dean, she's happy. This is what you do man. The repair shop continues Wednesdays on BBC One from 8pm.